I'm Karsten, the title prop, and welcome to the prop show. Hello, my friends. This video today is only a showcase. I want to show you uh, what I built and painted in the last two weeks. Uh, but before I start to talk, um, I want uh, to say thank you to Detlef from the uh, Independent Freelancer channel. Detlef sent me a little present. He sent me two little plastic bags full of pipettes. And uh, I'm very happy about this one. This is my first present from another modeler here uh, on YouTube. Uh, and uh, yes, Detlef, thank you very much for this one. If you need help uh, in weathering, painting, dusting, or other military stuff, um, please ask me. If you need my help, uh, I'm always there for you. Thank you very much. Okay, um, I built and painted in the last uh, two weeks uh, a German World War II tank. It was a paper tank. A paper tank is a tank uh, who was never on the battlefield and um, the German army had some plans for the future for the years 1945-1946 to build uh, and to develop new tanks uh, but uh, yeah we know it was too late and that's the reason why you call these kind of tanks uh, paper tanks because they are only as a layout on a paper. Uh, I tried to build and paint this tank here, it's a German VK6002 um, uh, Leopard. It's in scale 135 uh, from the company Hobby Boss. It's a very nice kit. I changed the track links. I used uh, the track links from Trumpeter. This one here. Uh, workable track links and uh, yeah, it was fun to build this one together. I tried to find uh, I tried to find a good color scheme uh, and not a normal co uh, color scheme or a special color scheme like it's a special tank it's a paper tank and I was looking for a special uh, paper tank color scheme I found this one here I tried to paint this one here it was not so easy but um, I think it looks nice you can find this kind of color scheme in the Camouflage Profile Guide 1945 German Colors here from Bing AK Interactive. <laughs> yeah, um, I show you now some pictures and uh, I catch you in a few minutes.
Okay, my friends. Now it's your part. Tell me what you think about the thing. Do you like the color scheme? Do you like how I made the dusting and that looks great? And the uh, the weathering stuff, or do you think maybe it's too much? I like uh, to. Uh, build a lot of dust and mud around the tank. I think it looks more real. Um, but yeah, please tell me what you think about my tank. Uh, if you like it or if you don't like it. Um, or oh, maybe do you have some ideas what I can do better the next time. Um, and uh, for sure I want to stay with uh, these kind of concept what I'm doing now for my channel. I want to do my scale modeling stuff, my uh, sci-fi and 40k modeling stuff and I want to mix this one together. I don't want to do um, always uh, the same like scale modeling and uh, or um, um, the sci-fi modeling. I want to mix this one. I have fun with this one. I want to stay with this one and uh, I think everybody's happy with this one. Or in the future I want to try to work a little bit more maybe with uh, the Flames of War and the bolt action and other things. But uh, yeah, this is for the future. Um, yeah, please type me what you think about my uh, tank. If you like it or if you don't like it. and. Uh, Maybe we can work a little bit more together. If you have questions about uh, the weathering, please ask me. I'm open for every question. Um, yeah, if you like my video, please uh, push the like button. If you like my channel and uh, the way how I make my videos, um, please subscribe and uh, share the video with your friends. Um, one important thing uh, next. Uh, Thursday, 7 o'clock UK time, uh, the Chilling War Gamers. Always fun, always anarchy, it's always a great show. Um, yeah, that's all in a moment. I hope I see you all on the next Google Hangout or uh, wherever. <laughs> I love you all. Bye bye.